I catch like maybe 70 to 80% of my deep goals like with those exact moves. Alex Davis, Raleigh Ring Fire. I'm about to show y'all how I get open. The first thing I always look for is just positioning, seeing how my defender setting up on me, as they often do, you know, being fast and whatnot. They'll often set over horizontally and vertically about three yards each way. And what I want to do is kind of address them. So I'll like start jogging out to them. I'll um, do what I call a nod, very slowly like rotate and start making my way under to my thrower. And the first thing I look for is looking for their right foot. And as soon as I get that step, is when I wanna make a super hard plant off my right foot explode diagonally. And the reason why I wanna explode diagonally instead of like vertically is because people often try to close the space between you and body you on like your outside hip. So I wanna plant hard, explode diagonally in order to kind of slip them or at least make their, their momentum hit somewhere over here and allows me to kind of slide by. This just gives me an advantage um, when cutting deep. And at that point, you pretty much just won the cut and creates a lot of separation, and then I almost always either draw deep help, or if I don't draw any deep help, it's just a, a throw off into easy clap catch goal. I think that's like probably the most important thing if you wanna dictate the cut and dictate where the play is just going in general.